Can you work while studying abroad? So I think this is a hot topic for a lot of international students because a lot of you also want to gain something more beyond just the study experience in a foreign country. So maybe your purpose is to get some extra money or maybe you want to pay for your living expenses and not burden your parents anymore or you just simply want to learn the culture or the language or maybe meet new people. So whatever the reasons is, a lot of you are also interested for work opportunities while finishing your studies overseas. The main question is can you work while studying as an international student in a foreign country the answer is depends so it depends on the regulation of that particular country there are countries where they have a strict regulations and therefore international students who are studying there under a student visa they're not allowed to work so it's completely illegal if you try to illegally work then you will definitely receive some consequences and in some cases if the government have a very strict policy then they might also deport you and let you go from that country so you don't want to do that so make sure to check the regulations uh, in that particular particular country to avoid anything illegal so you shouldn't do it if the university is not permitting you to do part-time jobs while studying however there are more and more countries nowadays that give such opportunities for international students if the country has the regulations where international students can do a part-time jobs then it means you can actually work and study at the same time Make sure you can balance your work and study because at the end of the day, your main job is to become a student because you are studying there. So make sure that you can still do well in school and also do well in your work. Based on the current regulations, there are several countries that allow international students to do part-time jobs legally while also studying at the university. Some of these countries are UK, France, Spain, Germany, Italy, Ireland, or Australia, and New Zealand. So majority of these countries are giving international students part-time job opportunities. So you can work up to about 20 hours per week, but that also depends on the country's uh, regulations. So from all the countries that I mentioned I'm going to cover like about five countries where you can work while studying in this video so in UK international students are allowed to work while studying and if you're studying longer than six months uh, on a tier 4 student visa then you are allowed to work for 20 hours per week during your study period and about 40 hours during vacation period which means you can actually working full-time during your holidays in Spain, international students can work for up to 20 hours per week. In addition to that, your employer might need to get or take care of the work permit for you so you can work temporarily for your part-time jobs. Italy also have a similar regulations to Spain. So in Italy, international students can also work for up to 20 hours per week. In Germany, international students have the opportunity to work full-time for a maximum of 120 days. Or if you are working part-time, you can work for an, a maximum of 240 days a year. However, this opportunity is not valid for language students. In Australia and New Zealand, you are also allowed to work part-time as an international student. So Australia will give you a maximum of 20 work hours per week. While in New Zealand, it's a similar regulations to UK where you can work for up to 20 hours per week during your studies and you can work for up to 40 hours per week during your vacation period. So what types of jobs are available for international students to do part-time? Well, there are several types of jobs that you can apply for. The first one is the on-campus jobs. So on-campus jobs means job scope are within the university. So you might be like, uh, let's say a teaching assistant, or maybe you can help in admissions office or in international students office. So there are numerous job opportunities in the university scope. So you can check with your university. Other than that, this can also be a great experience, especially if you like to meet new people or maybe if you want to learn the language or the culture more. 
And then other than that, you can also try to find some English teaching jobs. So especially if you're studying in a non-English speaking countries, usually there are plenty of opportunities where they look for native English speakers to teach English to kids or to adults or teach English online. So you can try to find such opportunities or teach your language. Maybe you're from China and you are studying in French or studying in Australia. There might be some opportunities where you can teach Chinese to the local people. There. there are also some tutoring and also translation work that you can do part-time. For example, you can tutor the elementary students or you can tutor the students in many different lessons like language or maybe music or you can also do some translation work. Let's say uh, you are translating from English to Chinese or English to Japanese or from other language to your mother language it is possible. Another common job is doing a part-time job at restaurants, bars or cafes so you can become waiter or you can help in the kitchen or as the cashier maybe so yeah it depends on uh, the type of job opportunities that they need at the moment but mainly such jobs are also available for international students and it can also be a good opportunity too to meet new people you can meet a ton of new people every day and you can also practice your language and especially if you are uh, trying to work in a restaurants or public places like that if you master the local language usually that will be preferred as well because that's going to be easier for you to communicate with the customers other than that there are definitely some office jobs and internships are uh, also available for international students so you can check if there are maybe some administrative office jobs or maybe some part-time jobs or like project-based jobs that you can do as an international students that you can work for part-time or like a short period of time doing the part-time jobs will definitely give you a lot of advantage especially for your future as well because you can definitely add that to your CV and it can help to boost your profile as well and then you can also learn a lot from these experiences from these unique opportunities for your future if you are interested to study overseas don't forget to also check out our website global admissions for university applications and if you have any questions about work and study opportunities or about studying overseas feel free to contact our team via email as well and feel free to share any interesting topics or maybe share some of your experience studying and working overseas on the comment below thank you i hope this helps see you on the next video